the only thing people obsessed with uh, brands with celebrities uh, and all of this crap it's uh, mass media and entertainment industry big brands invest huge amounts of money uh, into all aspects of entertainment industry to advertise their products uh, they give their products to actors uh, and then you see those products in the movies what kind of soap do you use in the shower yeah Dove? I like Dove. I like it. It doesn't dry your skin out so much. What is that on your feet? Mm. Converse All Stars, vintage 2004. Hey, <laughs> All I want is a Pepsi. You got a Happy Meal? Can we get a Happy Meal? Will somebody get the kid a Happy Meal? The pill. It's your car? Huh? give their products to uh, music stars, dancers, uh, they implement them into video games and into the books like everywhere and that's how they promote their products and that even could be very kind of hidden so you don't really see it at first. We've been pre-booking tickets for months. The park needs a new attraction every few years in order to reinvigorate the public's interest, kind of like the space program. When you, when you watch a movie, you take a role model, uh, especially when you're a kid. When you, when you watch a movie about some superheroes, you kind of associate a uh, main hero with yourself. Uh, they're very strong, they could solve any problem. They have very beautiful, sexy girl, which is like a trophy for them, as a reward for, for their hard work. Um, the main hero always wear Ray-Ban sunglasses, they smoke Marlboro, they use iPhones, they, you know, they speak with people only with iPhones, they pay with Visa, they drink only Coca-Cola and Red Bulls, very bad guys drink Red Bulls, they wear jeans, Levis, and um, they drive Porsche and now Tesla. And of course, you associate that with yourself and you think, even on an unconscious level, that that's cool. That's, in fact, that's how the trends are created. And it's been like so for, a for ages, since the invention of the mass media, the invention of radio, TV, and um, yeah. I don't, well, how, what can I do? Gee, honey, it's really very simple. If you wanted to have a dinner, well, all you gotta do is get a box of post alphabets, pour some in a bowl, pour some milk on them, and you're in business. Now, you've had post alphabets. They're absolutely wonderful. They're shaped like all the letters in the alphabet, from A to Z. And they're made of oats, which is the best source of high-quality protein. 